In April 1937, the BBC broadcast a radio talk by one of the leading writers of the 20th century. This is the only surviving record of the voice of Virginia Woolf. Words, English words, were full of echoes, memories, associations. And that is one of the chief difficulties in writing in today. Fifty years later, another great writer was in the spotlight, quizzed about his new novel, The Satanic Verses. What's true about the book is that it does break a number of taboos, which, in my view, are very important to break. From Virginia Woolf to Salman Rushdie, this is the story of the 20th century British novel as told by the writers themselves. Why are you appearing in this program? Poverty. Many of these recordings have never been heard since. The Count got off his horse, unfastened his breeches, and thrust his virile member into the dead girl. I think there's a great deal of ignorant bumptiousness on the part of scientists these days. As a novelist, one is just the, uh, the pupil of the great novelists of the past. I feared the possibility that the state was all too ready to start taking over our brains and turning us into good little citizens. In this program, we see some of the giants who made their name in the first half of the 20th century, many filmed for television in later life. We hear how they captured the spirit of the age, whether confronting war and fascism, or the frivolity and decadence of disillusioned youth. 28, take two and more. You think it went all right? I think it went. I think it had some nice things in it. Thank you.